What's up, guys? This is Victor Bell, the general, founder of the Champion Army, creator of the Champion Army War College, where I help male entrepreneurs wage war and get badass results in their business, bodies, and their lives. With a quick question for you today, I want you to consider something. Would you bet on yourself? Would you bet on yourself to win? The challenge is that most male entrepreneurs don't see themselves as champions. Well, let me explain that to you. I see male entrepreneurs as champions. We're all champions. We've all went out, and the definition of champions are people who go out and they conquer, they win. They conquer and they divide and they win. They win for themselves and they win for other people. The challenge is that most guys out there in entrepreneurial spaces aren't willing to bet on themselves, weigh it all on the line. Now, they bet, but they don't bet at all. Even though everybody around them in their industry, in their lives, their families, are all betting that they're going to win even though that entrepreneur has a plan and has bet against himself. So every day he makes a plan to lose while everyone else has made a plan to win for him, with him, hoping and praying that this guy goes out every day, comes home with the brass ring or the Kessler, and everybody wins and everybody benefits from it, yet he doesn't. Yet you are not. You have to be willing to bet on yourself. One of the things that I've asked people, and I'll ask again, some guys like, do you have or can you go get a million dollars? Can you get 50,000? Can you get 100,000? And they're like, no, I can't. I can't raise that much yet. Or I don't know how. Or I don't know this. And I'm like, well, let me ask you a different question. If I were to grab one of your kids or your wife or your mom or somebody you cared about deeply, and I was like, I will kill them tomorrow, or I'll kill them in a week, or I'll kill them in 12 months, whatever. They will be gone from this earth, ripped from your grasp, if you don't go raise this money and meet me at the bank, and then I'll smash their hands on the phone, and I'll let you hear them scream, and I'll say, if you think I'm playing, try me, and I hang up, and I go, you got X amount of days, hours, a year, you better fight like hell to do it. You see... Most of those guys, when I ask that question, oh, yeah, I'm going to go get that money. I'm going to go do this and I'm going to go do that. So the thing what I want you to recognize is if you were in that situation, you'd go find it. You'd do whatever it took. When only a few minutes ago you said that you didn't have the wherewithal, you didn't have the know-how, you didn't have the contacts, you didn't have the knowledge. But when you realize that all of those can'ts are the real you, you're the one keeping them hostage. You can help them. You can free them from the bondage that you're currently putting them in because you aren't willing to go the extra mile and wage war to get it. That's the difference of a champion. And that's the difference of somebody who only competes. You see, you are a conqueror. You have to understand that to get what you want, you have to be willing to put the strategies in place to wage war to go get it. Most guys don't know how to do that. You see, I've been there, bro. I sat down, man, and I was lost everything in business and under, underestimating who I was as a person. I questioned who I was as a man, not an entrepreneur, as a man, about what I was capable of for my family again. And I cried out, and I was like, God, what is it that you want me to do? I thought I did everything right. I was a defeated champion, knowing that I knew how to win, that I had won, that I had the belt around my waist and my hand raised high in the air, that I was a champion. And I had been defeated, knocked down, blindsided by what I thought was there to keep me down. But it was just designed to make me freaking know what I was capable of and wage war to fucking go get it. I put together the strategies and the tactics necessary and I got my shit back. I fought for my family and freed them. Freed myself. I made it my mission to help men like you who feel like you're defeated champions who want to have their hand raised again in victory. I made it my mission to help you. I made it my mission to put together strategies to teach you how to go out and wage war again for what you fucking believe in and win. Yet I find some guys will reach out asking questions. How do I win? How do I get it all back? And then when it's time to put that wager up, bet it all on the line again, they aren't willing to do it. And then they wonder why they continue to fail. Take a look at some of the things that you do. Understand that in order for you to have what you want, you must be willing to wage war to fucking get it. 
Know that it's time for you to get a coach and a mentor and join an army of champion men just like you that all want their hand raised. And you will begin to see the light of day again. You'll begin to see who you really are as a conqueror. And that's what I want to help you do. Go to championarmywarcollege.com and fill out that application. Let's you and I have a conversation. Let's talk about getting you war ready so you can fucking start to win again and be the man that you know that you're supposed to be. That you were created to be by God himself. You have a mission, a calling. You're a conqueror. You're a champion. It's time. It's time to wage war and get those badass results for yourself. You owe it to your life. You owe it to your family. You owe it to yourself to be who you were created to be. Serve your purpose. Serve your mission. Or sit there. Never speak of this again. Never speak of ever wanting to win again. Never tell anybody that you won at any point. It doesn't deserve a conversation like that. Stay defeated. That's a choice. And that choice is yours. Go to championarmywarcollege.com. Fill out that application. Let's set up some time for me and you to talk. And I'll teach you how to create, apply, and flick. Panic, pressure, and pain to stretch and grow and get those badass results that you know are there for you. No love. It's time for you to get up and wage war. Get what's yours.